EVS 11 introduces the concept of value-based colouring with our Colour Map Engine. The Colour Map Engine allows you to automatically colour the text or background of a spreadsheet display of a series or group based upon the data values of the underlying series or any other series in the work file. To demonstrate, we have a work file containing quarterly US macroeconomic data from 1980 to 2012. To begin, we'll open up the GDP underscore CH series, which contains a simple one period percentage change in gross domestic product. We can change the colouring of this series by clicking on the Properties button and then Text Colour. By default, the text colour is set to a single colour, black. We can change this using the Type drop down. To begin, we'll change to simple positive negative colouring which will put negative values in red. If we want to extend this further, we could go back and change to a single range of colours. Here we will set any values below 0 to be red and any values above 2 to be green. And everything else black. Not only can we colour a series based upon its own values, but we can colour based upon the values of a separate series. Here we'll open up the investment series and create simple positive negative colouring based upon the values of the change in GDP. You can even use expressions. So, for example, I can colour based upon the absolute value of the change in GDP rather than the raw change itself. If we want more complicated colouring schemes, we can use the custom setting to create our own ranges and thresholds. Here we have a series of integers between 1 and 50, with a number of custom colouring options already added. We will add a final colour range for values between 40 and 50, giving a fade between two colours, blue and green. We will call our range 40 to 50. We can see that we quickly added the ability to distinguish the values of the series by colour. If we sort the series by its values, we can obtain a nice rainbow-like effect.